Hello everyone! Today we will learn how to titrate a VA sample collected from a cash still and how to calculate the concentration of acetic acid in the sample. We start by adding a few drops of phenolphthalein indicator to our sample. We add a stir bar to our flask and place the sample on a stirring plate underneath our titration burette. We are titrating an acid, so we will use a base, in our case 0.1 normal sodium hydroxide for our titration. Before you begin, record the starting volume of sodium hydroxide in your burette. In our case, the burette is full, so the starting volume is zero. You can now turn the stir plate on. You are now ready to begin your titration. Titrate slowly and notice the change in color due to the phenolphthalein indicator. Continue titrating until the light pink color persists for a few seconds. We are now close to the end of our titration. Slow your addition even more and continue the process until the light pink persists for about 30 seconds. We have now reached the end of our titration. Now make a note of the total volume of sodium hydroxide used in the process. In our case, we used 2 milliliters. It is now time for the calculation. This is the formula we are going to use. You will need to know the concentration of the sodium hydroxide solution used, in this case 0.1 normal, the volume of sodium hydroxide that was used during the titration, we used 2 milliliters, and the volume of wine that we started with, which was 10 milliliters. Plug it all in and you will get your result. 1.2 grams per liter acetic acid in our case. And that's it for this video. I hope you all found it useful. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.